millions of Americans gathered with their families today for Thanksgiving feast, but some people are not as fortunate because they don't have family members to visit. The Salvation Army helped bring some holiday cheer by delivering meals. Here's Casey Freeman with more. The holiday season is the busiest time of year for the Salvation Army. For Thanksgiving, the Chattanooga office fed more than 500 people in need and in Cleveland, more than 300. This group of four has cooked almost 60 turkeys and sprayed several pans for dressing. The goal is to feed as many people who can't leave their homes as possible this Thanksgiving. Adair Darlin has received a meal from the Salvation Army every year since she moved into Dogwood Manor nine years ago. It means something special to get Thanksgiving dinner. Lots of people don't have family here in Chattanooga or don't have family at all. It's taken Chef Terry Epps a week to prepare enough food, but he's been doing this for 10 years. He says it's more than delivering a meal. It's about giving a smile. What does a smile do? It, it changes your attitude. It changes your life for that one moment. Epps says each year he enjoys creating this meal and hearing feedback is rewarding. We get cards from um, from an enormous amount of people that we have served that, that Thanksgiving dinner to. Um, you know, they, they really appreciate it. We're very grateful that we have our health. We live in such a beautiful building. Um, uh, we're, we're well staffed. For those who would like to make a donation or volunteer, you still have plenty of time to do so. The Salvation Army is in need of coats or other warm clothing. You can also pick an angel from the angel tree to give a gift in hopes of making a child's holiday season brighter. In the studio, Casey Freeman, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Casey.